Welcome to Trade Along. Today, we are diving into the exciting world of five-year U.S. Treasury note trading. Our strategy will focus on trading in the short direction. We will cover everything from expected value, the optimal position size, initiating the trade with a credit spread, managing stop losses, Understanding the profit point. Whether you are a beginner or an experienced trader, this guide will provide valuable insights to enhance your trading strategy. For beginners, we recommend risking 0.5% of your total portfolio and no more than 50% of your total account. For more experienced traders, we recommend using up to 2% positions while risking up to 75% of your account. Trade along. Calculate your maximum position size by considering the maximum risk for your experience level and applying that to your account size. If we assume an annual earning goal of 53% and hold the option for 19 days with a maximum risk of $5,000, we need an expected value from the artificial intelligence of 199 based on this calculation. Trade along. To calculate your required expected value, take the annual percentage you aim to earn, multiply it by the previously calculated maximum risk, and then multiply by the years to expiry. Initially, we use AI-generated code to perform a backtest for trading five-year U.S. Treasury notes using futures contracts. This involves selecting various limit orders and stop losses for the asset, then choosing the combination that offers the best expected value. The backtest results indicate a stop loss of 0.31%, a limit order of 2.38%, and a maximum contract risk, ensuring that the stop loss can be applied without exceeding the maximum risk if the position is assigned. Our calculations show an expected value of 453 if the position gets assigned. Using this AI-generated code, we then backtest various strike prices and options configurations to enter this futures contract trade. Here is the backtest with the highest expected value. This strategy involves a call credit spread. A call credit spread is an option strategy where you sell a call option at a lower strike price and buy a call option at a higher strike price, earning a premium for the spread. We have decided to sell at 106.5 and buy at 107 to enter the position, thereby earning a premium for waiting. This call credit spread has an expiry date of July 26, 2024, a delta of 0.4, and is calculated using 10 contracts. This setup offers a reward of $1,298 with a risk of $3,702. Based on an AI-generated backtest, the system has calculated a probability of success of 0.85. The expected value, therefore, is $547 for 19 days of holding, which exceeds our required expected value of $199. You can use this probability for your trade calculations as needed. Trade along, assess both the potential risk and reward of the trade, and then use the probability to determine the expected value. Adjust the trade size according to your maximum risk tolerance and make sure the expected value surpasses the required threshold before proceeding. We initially analyzed this trade from an expected value standpoint, considering it as a credit spread while keeping the potential for assignment in mind. Ultimately, this trade allows us to earn a premium from the option. If it gets assigned, we can manage it as a regular trade at a favorable price. To make sure this trade aligns with your portfolio, verify that you don't have other trades in the same category and direction with the same expiry date. Additionally, limit your portfolio according to the risk management guidelines discussed earlier in the video. Thank you for watching. 
If you found this guide helpful, please like, share, and subscribe for more trading insights. Happy trading! You could be our 12th subscriber. Please note, this video is for educational purposes and not financial advice.